Hamilton. Well, first of all, uh, all of our ministers will be leaving councils uh, as soon as the legislation goes through, which we're expecting to be in the, the autumn, which will ensure that uh, we won't have literally hundreds of by-elections around the, the country, which would uh, cost the, the ratepayer a very considerable amount. So that is simply a matter of time before uh, that reduction takes place. Uh, I want to keep uh, some experience. Samuel will probably be the, and I say this as a, a former finance minister, he'd probably be the best qualified fi finance minister that there's been for many decades uh, in Northern Ireland. Uh, and it's a, it's a matter as of a former keeping. economics teacher, you mean? Well, he's, more than being a, a former economics teacher, he was the head of the economics department. He was also one of those who's responsible for setting uh, economic uh, exams, and uh, he was also marking economic exams. So he's a very wide experience in that area of activity. Uh, one surprise, perhaps, uh, Robin Newton's appointment as a junior minister. Is he being groomed to take over from you, perhaps, in uh, East Belfast, as we uh, assume you will be standing down at the next uh, Westminster election? Well, Rob and I have known of his uh, skills and ability for some considerable time. And I think anybody that uh, had been in at the Detty Committee meetings would see just how much of a contribution he has to, to make. Uh, and it, it's important as we move members of parliament out that we increase the skill base that we have within our assembly group. And I think you'll see he's a very capable politician. Nelson McCausland as culture minister, uh, a man, a very vocal supporter of Ulster Scots culture. Will he be open minded when it comes to Irish aspects of culture, such as GAA and Irish language? Well, I think that we've seen over the last few days, particularly with the parading uh, in North Belfast, that there is a real requirement for people to uh, have respect for other traditions uh, and that's a two-way street and I think we must recognise that there, there is an importance to uh, be able to allow people to freely express their, their own uh, culture and of course Nelson is somebody who has advocated Ulster Scots and is regarded as being one of the leading proponents uh, will recognise as he uh, is passionate about it in terms of Ulster Scots and other people will be passionate uh, about uh, their own particular culture. The DUP leader Peter Robinson 